In a sleepy English village north of London lives a man for whom driving distance has long been an obsession. Meet two-time world long drive champion Joe Miller. Look where this car stands. Almost carries 420. freaky kid playing the local competitions i'd be hit out hitting the adults i was 11 12 years old and hitting it 300 350 yards miller is responsible for some of the longest drives ever recorded and routinely hits the ball well over 400 yards with size and speed that would put even the likes of bryson DeChambeau to shame it takes some specialist equipment in the bag to keep up the clubs themselves are legal to use in any type of golf environment. So PJ Tour, European Tour, your Saturday, Sunday medals, all these golf clubs are fully legal. So the differences between a Tour Pros driver, which would be something like that, and a long drive driver, OK? First of all, like I say, you've got the difference in length. So obviously, the reason we do that is to maximise distance. We're not trying to necessarily hit every ball as straight as we can, but we are trying to hit every single ball as long as we can. Whilst the clubs and the drives may be slightly longer than the Tour Pros, the data being tracked is almost identical. OK, let's have a look at some of the numbers. Just go through... There's a half-decent one, it's 401 yards. So obviously distance is, uh, you know, that's, that's probably the, that's the end goal. Uh, what we look at, first of all, is things like club head speed, ball speed. Um, for, for long drive especially, the spin is key. So how much the ball is, is spinning backwards. So club head speed, 143 miles an hour. Uh, launch angle was around 14 degrees. And it was low spinning. Ball travel, 401 yards. It's not bad, it's a warm-up kind of a shot. With the World Long Drive Tour on hold, Miller has had plenty of time to take in the PGA Tour in recent weeks, and he doesn't believe the trend for long hitting in the game is going away anytime soon. It's a massive trend right now. It's the, it's the number one topic. You know, what these guys are doing now, what, I mean, guys like Bryson especially, we all know what, what he's produced in the last sort of six months. You know, he's, he's hid, hid himself away during a lockdown probably, gone in the gym, he's bulked up. Then he goes out and he swings 100 drivers as fast as he can. There's no real secret to it. That is the way we've always done it. That's how long drivers have done it. We've just done it for a little bit longer than they have. He knows in, in 10 years' time or 15 years' time, long drive, it might be a long driver on the tour. You know, hitting 150 miles an hour and driving par fives. I don't know. You just don't know where it's going to end. So it will continue, yeah.